Good morning, I'm Sharon Tang. And I'm Sandra Mitchell in today for Rick Garcia. Welcome to CBS 2 News at 11 a.m. Thank you. The last day of the holiday weekend is no calmer than the first two. Lifeguards are bracing for more rescues as dangerous surf conditions pound the coast. Jasmine Veal is live in Malibu along PCH with a look at those dangerous conditions. Jasmine. The two people looking to spend their Labor Day outdoors found themselves in trouble. A woman hiking to Mescal Ridge. A staffer for New York Governor Andrew Cuomo is fighting for his life. He was among three people shot in an outburst of violence ahead of the West Indian Day Parade in Brooklyn. 43-year-old Carrie Gabay was shot in the head around three West Indian Parade, while a second man is recovering from his injury. President Obama brought some good news to thousands of workers on this Labor Day. I saw a new effort to free the Kentucky clerk who is in jail for defying the Supreme Court's ruling on same-sex marriage. All right, coming up, doctors say teenagers have discovered a new way to inhale marijuana. And undercover fans. Students are using their e-cigarettes to get high. Researchers at Yale tracked 4,000 teens. 